the phone screen at Amazon. Recruiter for screens are really important. They're definitely informal, so you don't have to prep that much, but it's really, really great to be able to answer a few foundational questions that are asked frequently. So I often recommend to people to spend like maybe an hour uh, of their time, maybe hour and a half prepping for this and just being comfortable with this interview. Here's uh, what you wanna do first. Amazon does their interviews on Chime and Chime can be a little bit clunky. It's uh, kind of an alternative to Zoom and Google Meets. So before your interview even starts, make sure you download it and run it with a buddy once to make sure you know how to use it. I can't tell you how many Amazon recruiters have told me it really sucks when the interview starts and the person sort of fumbles around to try to get on. Uh, and then when they finally do get on, they're obviously anxious because they spent a few uh, minutes trying to connect. Don't be that person, spend a minute downloading Chime, make sure you're ready. These are the questions that you're going to get asked in the phone screen. And this is super, super common. What happens, obviously yours might differ, but these are from uh, compiled from real interviews in the last month. Tell me about yourself. Walk me through your resume or your background. What are you interested in Amazon? What does a day at your job now look like? And which leadership principle do you connect with the most? Let's break these down a little bit. So in Tell Me About Yourself, the recruiter is looking for kind of a few sound bites what, uh, and what they could remember you by. So be very quick to talk about things that you're passionate about, things that uh, are interesting about you. Don't give the recruiter a full run through of your professional experience. This should take you 45 seconds to answer. If you're struggling with this question, go ahead and watch this video on our YouTube channel or also read the article. Uh, about how to answer this. There's a formula, just use the formula, don't stray from it, it's really easy to do, um, and you will ace this. Next, walk me through your resume or background. Same here, recruiter's not looking for you to read every single thing on your resume. Uh, recruiters can read, guys, don't do this. This is super, super bad, bad signal in an interview, disrespectful of a recruiter's time. When they ask to uh, get walked through the resume, they're really looking for the highlights there. So what are things that you're proud of at each job or what are things you wanna pull out that you really want them to know? Uh, so give them the highlights, talk about broadly how, what your experience is, how it relates to the role. While you're interested in Amazon, be very authentic in this answer. If there's a specific team or product or value that you resonate with, this is the time to say it. What does a day look like at your job? This is a great question to talk about the scale and complexity of your job. So make sure you give examples that use the same keywords the job description mentioned and um, have that done ahead of time. So this is one of the things you could prep on, read the JD, uh, look through exactly what the role demands and make sure that you talk about your role in a similar way uh, so that you could help the recruiter pattern match. Which leadership principle do you connect with the most? Uh, this is important, so definitely make sure you study every single leadership principle before your interview. This is something you should do for Amazon. They really care about this. So you should absolutely be prepared to talk about this uh, and help your recruiter out by being prepared. The recruiter then decides whether or not you want, they will move you forward. And this is important because Every single time I speak to a candidate, they're like, oh, I'm so annoyed I have to do the screen. Don't be that person. Recruiters are your biggest advocates inside of an organization. Treat them kindly, treat them right. I promise they will open a million doors for you. Recruiters also move around a ton. So this is not just for Amazon, this is for every other job you're gonna need in your career. So make sure that you take this seriously and you prep for the screen just as you would for any other interview. Then we have video interviews, and these are two 30-minute interviews with Amazonians from your function. So if you're a PM, you'll get a product manager, a case study to work on. If you're an engineer, you're going to do some coding. If you're a data scientist, you're going to work on uh, stuff as well. In an ops role, you're probably going to talk uh, more about behavioral questions and kind of deeper dive into your background. Uh, so this is something that uh, everybody goes through this kind of the second more formal round. And after this, you're brought on for what's called the on-site loop. We're gonna talk about the on-site loop next time. So tune in and would love to tell you about that.